welcome to Linux Fork. My name is Chandan and friends in this video I am going to show you how we can configure auto start and stop for the Azure VM. And friends why we need uh, auto start and stop for Azure VM because the main purpose of doing this auto start and stop things we are we want to save our cost okay so on cloud things we need to save our cost because whatever the things we are doing everything has at the some point the cost is involved for everything whatever the things is running here either the storage vm compute part or whatever the services you are using here we are giving some money to the age, uh, cloud provider so here we want to save some cost okay so suppose inside your vm uh, some application is running that application uh, you are using for that some particular time so suppose 6 am to 6 pm just uh, in day you are using that particular application then after 6 pm you can stop that particular vm till 6 am right so uh, it's going to save your cost so that is the purpose to uh, schedule or configure the, uh, the configure the vm how to start and stop okay so how we can do this and uh, uh, how we can achieve this we i'm going to show that so for that actually we need uh, one automation account and one log analytics workspace so just click right click here and click create resource just search here a start a stop okay so you will see here a start a stop vm during off hours so just click on there here it will show you these things this is the prerequisite okay so these things we have to create first then we will uh, click here and create other resources so uh, let, let's say create first automation account and then uh, we will create uh, other log analytics workspace so let's create just select particular uh, resource group then give name okay uh, i'm just giving my auto okay and uh, select that particular some particular region in which you, i'm just creating in central india and just next I'm going with default uh, option. I just review and create. Okay. Now search log analytics. Just select log analytics workspace. Create. Oh, sorry. Just select that. Create. Choose that particular uh, uh, resource group okay now give some name my hyphen work a space okay and central india i have selected review and create it so validation is going on so validation passed now just click on create so the deployment initialized okay so it will take some time guys so once it's created then we will proceed for next so as we can see uh, our log analytics workspace deployment completed now before pro proceeding next we have to go automation account okay just select that particular automation account go to uh, just search here run edge okay run 
and then you will find run as account so this is the uh, required things you have to uh, create run as account first before proceeding next because if it is not there then the auto start and the stop things it's it's not going to work for you and run as account only a, a subscription administrator and owner can enable or create that particular account okay other uh, user don't have that permission okay so just check out that that part okay here I am the owner that's why I'm going to create that uh, run as account okay just I'm clicking uh, I'm going to create it after clicking on create so uh, as we can see uh, it's uh, deploying or creating that uh, as your run as account okay so uh, let's go to that part and uh, once it's completed then we will proceed here and then uh, we will create that uh, a start and a stop things okay so let's wait for that it's deploying so as we can see uh, this run as account created now just go to this tab and click create select uh, workspace okay my workspace now automation account we have to select and guys if you are coming first time on my channel please like share and subscribe and uh, guys it's taking lot of effort to create the videos and uh, and also one thing i just want to tell because my video may be lengthy but uh, whatever the things is there i'm giving de detailed things okay so that's why maybe it, it's going longer sometime okay and other things uh, please watch this video till end because uh, at the end i will show uh, where you have to see uh, the error logs so suppose if you are facing some issue you can troubleshoot that part okay and so let's choose automation account this one now just configuration so here is the limitation guys so suppose if you given a star then whatever the beam running in that particular it's actually a star means all the resource group right so here we have to specify that particular res uh, resource group name okay a star means every resource group and whatever the vm is running it's going to stop so we want to give that particular uh, resource group name so where uh, my vm is running it's running rg under uh, hyphen test resource group so just copy that okay and paste here so just uh, i'm targeting this resource group okay under that if you want to exclude some vm suppose in this resource group you have some other vm also so suppose you have uh, three vm and in three vm you want to stop two vm so two vm because we have targeted resource group so it's going to stop all three vm okay right so if you want to exclude some vm here then you have to mention here exclude inside in exclude so suppose you have uh, vm1 vm2 vm3 so vm1 and vm2 you want to stop then it's going to a stop here and you want to exclude vm3 then you have to mention here otherwise it's going to stop all three vm okay so that's why vm3 you don't want then you have to mention here in in, in exclude and also you can uh, mention multiple vm by comma okay you can separate that with comma so that is the things here you have to mention timing okay for a start and for a stop okay here if you want to receive some mail you you can mention here okay that is uh, uh, depends upon your requirement and uh, here i don't want any mail or anything so just i'm selecting no and go ahead okay 
क्लिक को के राइट हेयर वी हैव टू चेंज द नेम रिसोर्स ग्रुप नेम राइट आरजी टेस्ट आरजी हाइफन टेस्ट क्लिक ओके अगेन यू हैव टू क्लिक ओके नाउ इन स्लाइजिंग डिप्लॉयमेंट ओके सो द डिप्लॉयमेंट स्टार्टेड नो इट विल टेक टाइम हाउ मच अबाउट ट्वेंटी टू ट्वेंटी फाइव मिनट इट विल टेक ओके सो लॉट ऑफ प्रोसेस इज गोइंग बिहाइंड द सीन सो इट इट विल टेक लॉट ऑफ टाइम इट्स डिपेंड अपॉन द लाइक ऑपरेशन हाउ मच ऑपरेशन दे आर गोइंग टू परफॉर्म बिहाइंड द सीन सो इट विल टेक ट्वेंटी टू ट्वेंटी फाइव मिनट्स टाइम So just uh, I I'm going to uh, skip this part, okay? So as we can see, uh, the deployment is completed, okay? So it took about fifteen minute, okay, to complete this. Now just go to automation account, okay? Select that automation account. Ah. Uh, go to run books here you can see so many power cell models they have uh, imported right during that time the process taken because uh, behind the scene these models they are implementing okay that now the thing is here uh, just uh, go to syllable okay uh, so everything it's look fine right here we have to change the uh, time zone here otherwise uh, suppose we have selected that particular time but it's not matching with time zone then the start and the stop will fail right so here we have to uh, change according to our need so for uh, currently this vm it's running right so i'm just uh, uh, going to schedule a, a stop okay so just select a stop one and uh, here uh, today is uh, 10 right so i'm just selecting date 10 okay and i'm just giving time here 15 minute should be there right so currently time is 11 6 right so 15 uh, so 15 and 6 20 one right so i'm just giving 21 pm so it will take right and here is the uh, recurrence so daily uh, it will give daily weekly hourly and monthly option so it's a daily i'm just selecting daily so if you select weekly now so suppose if you selected weekly so here they will give days so that is the things yeah i'm just selecting and daily okay just save it okay so uh, this vm uh, which vm it's running it's going to a stop at 1121 okay so at 1121 this vm it's going to a stop uh, one more thing we have to change the time zone because i didn't changed so your time zone should be uh, same okay Save it. Okay. Now it's going to a stop at eleven twenty one. Now uh, change for other also time zone. Okay. so we have changed that time zone right okay so we can wait for uh, 
uh, stopping that particular PM and then I will uh, go next okay then I will show where we can see the logs and uh, uh, if you are facing some error then how we can trouble so next step okay so just I am waiting uh, till uh, uh, 11.21 okay So friends, as we can see, this VM is uh, deallocating. Okay, after some time, it will uh, show as a stopped. Okay, because we have uh, scheduled it at 11:21 p.m. So as we can see, it's deallocating. Okay. So what logs uh, it will generate? We will see here. Okay, so VM successfully stopped. Okay, now just go to activity log okay so as you can see right it's a uh, my automation event initiated by you can see here right uh, in full you can see this one so uh, from automation account this event is initiated some id is coming here right so deallocated uh, deallocate VM, uh, virtual machine okay so vm has stopped a minute ago so that things other things what you can check so just go to automation account select that go to uh, jobs okay now okay here you just go to a stop one parent okay action a stop and output you will see okay triggered uh, here uh, one minute guys some place uh, one more is there right just select child one you can see in child one right so uh, action a stop okay and go to output you will see here a stopping the virtual machine bm right this is the name of the bm successfully a stop that a virtual machine beam so uh, this is the thing suppose if you are facing some error it will show here in errors warnings it will show here all logs it will come here so you can see success a uh, full test of the virtual machine beam right good uh, here it's uh, also mentioning the time so uh, that is the things guys uh, I have shown you in detail this okay regarding this uh, auto a start and a stop things for azure bm and uh, guys if you like this please uh, subscribe my channel and also uh, i know this uh, video is a li little bit lengthy but because i have given all the details regarding this so that's why it should take in some time okay so that's all guys in this video please like share and subscribe thank you